my top 30 Cameroonian delicacies of food. Grab a seat because this video is going to make you salivate. It's okay to salivate, but don't go away. hello beautiful people it's your girl claudia and welcome back to my channel on today's episode i'm bringing to you 30 top cameroonian delicacies cameroon is blessed with food we have a lot before we get started please hit the subscribe button and turn on the notifications so you don't miss out when i post any of my videos most of the food i'll be bringing to you today i have the recipes on my channel i'm going to put some of the links in the description box for you to check it out the first delicacy here is cocky beans this dish is mouth watering it is made with black eyed peas soaked blended and with some palm oil and other ingredients you can definitely enjoy it with plantains sweet potatoes yam or whatsoever you choose the next on my list is goat meat pepper soup. Pepper soup, you have many spices. People cook it differently and it really tastes good. Peppered or spicy snails. You can either call it slow boys or nyamangoro, short form nyama. It has a lot of names in Cameroon. Snails are rich in protein and low in fat, so please definitely eat snails. It is common with people in the southwest region of Cameroon. The next here is this amazing, juicy, delicious grilled mackerel or roasted fish. My side here is quackoco, onions, and some pepper sauce. In Cameroon, we have many ways in which we marinate or grill the fish. Goosey soup. A goosey soup is made from pumpkin seeds and you can put some green leaves inside like bitter leaves or spinach and any protein you like. Enjoy it with gari, fufu, plantains or whatever. Banana malaxe is the next. It's just unripe bananas cooked with blended or ground peanuts it's really really good it's tasty especially when made spicy and with smoked fish poulet deje on my list who does not like poulet deje in cameroon our parents made us believe that only rich people enjoy this meal but nowadays anybody can eat it it is just stir fried chicken and half ripe plantains cooked with tomatoes onion green beans carrots and many types of veggies mm -hmm. poo fish in cameroon some people are like why will i be eating plantain and plantain this is because the soup is made with ground dry plantains and you enjoy it with boiled plantains so they are like why eat plantains and plantains but trust me it's worth it this food is mouth watering it's really really good Next on my list is ekwang. Some people say ekwang, so I don't even know which one is the correct pronunciation. Just come down to the comments and tell me, <laughs> tell me which one is correct. Made with grated cocoa yams, wrapped in cocoa yam leaves. Nowadays, people use different types of leaves. Next is pak coco bible. My southwest people, my Bakwari people. This is your delicacy: grated cocoa yams wrapped in plantain leaves with your everyday ingredients. Another delicacy here is fried rice. In Cameroon, we have different ways in which we cook and enjoy rice. Either we eat it with beans, stew, or we fry it or make it as jollof. Another delicacy is dole. This is my favorite meal. Dole, just imagine the sweetness of the peanuts and the bitterness of the leaves infused together to give you that taste. Oh my goodness sweet yams i definitely love sweet yams who does not love sweet yams another is bongo chubby 
this one it has a dark color like black soup just because of the roasted traditional spices made in it you can enjoy it with cassava but plantain is the best that goes with it next on my list is egusi pudding in egusi pudding is just pumpkin seed blended with some ingredients wrapped in leaves and boiled eru eru is it eru or eru whatsoever just bring fufu and let me show you how it's eaten the next is grilled or roasted plantain with palm oil and pear just have it for breakfast or for dinner bobolo and granite paste i can have this dish three times per day and i will be very very okay another is bitter leaf soup and fufu this bitter leaf soup you can eat it with whatever side it must not only be fufu anything you have it goes with it we have stew this one to be specific is chicken stew we have fish stew kanda stew many types of stew making cameroon just bring rice and i'll show you how we eat eating cc plantain or porridge plantain is another one just put some smoked fish meat or any protein of your choice we have fried kidney red beans or fried red kidney beans here another is corn chaff that's corn cooked with beans and our favorite or everyday ingredients achu is the next my bamenda people bafut bambili where you at come let's enjoy this achu delicacy fried cabbage and beef who does not like fried cabbage just bring some plantains and i will show you how it's eaten like i said before we have different types of stew this one is fish stew check the description box because i have recipes of these meals okongobong soup or pumpkin leaf soup this one in fact i don't need to explain much if you've tasted it you know what i mean we have some peppered kanda or spicy kanda fried with tomatoes onion and any other ingredients of your choice fufu corn and kati kati jaman jama pepe in fact what we talk about kati kati is just roasted or grilled chicken cooked with palm oil the next here is jollof rice it's different from the fried rice i showed before this one is just jollof rice you can eat it with any protein chicken beef fish or whatsoever but trust me it's amazing we have garden egg stew or eggplant stew but in Cameroon we we'll call it garden egg we've come to the end of this video for today so let me know in the comment section which Cameroonian dish is your favorite and which one you haven't yet tried out and you would love to try it out Wow. lastly check out my other recipes on my channel i bet you they are amazing thanks so much for watching bye bye